Hello, guys. <coughs> Why do I always cough when I'm recording? Well, as you see, I added all these here and blah 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 and bish bash bish bash and added some uh, grills or whatever you want to call it. Um, and then I realized. Uh, I accidentally deleted the engine. So, uh, I have no idea. What do you think? Let's have a look. Which I think I might leave out anyway, so. But I guess we could. Uh, that's uh, add something here. Oh, we'll just add that there. Some thickness. Uh, so let's see. Let's grab this face. Bring it all the way out, and we can just bring it about here, and let's grab uh, an edge here and split, and we can just bring that up to there. Do the same thing to here. We'll just bring this across like so. We're just going to do something different. Click in there and just drag in. And we'll just grab this edge and just drag it out. And the same with this one. Out. Press G. Grab this one, and this one can come out like so. I'm just winging this at the moment, just seeing what we have going on here. I mean I didn't mean on uh, deleting it. It just uh, happened that way. So just grab these edges and just bring this down. Like so. Grab this edge, just bring that out. Okay. Let's bring this up just a bit. Got this face and actually let's uh, mirror this. So you want to mirror it in the X. Something like that. I mean I wish I didn't delete and save that now. So uh, another lesson for you um, never s always save in different files because if you accidentally delete something uh, it will come to bite you in the arse. So 
grab these and just bring that. I'm just, like I said, just I'm just going with uh, whatever at the moment. Face is on, is on, and extrude, and let's bring the offset in, and we can add some thickness. Maybe let's bring this out. Press G and we'll just do it the old fashioned way. I mean, it doesn't look even so. I mean, this offset on here makes everything even. So let's bring. and bring that back in uh, the thickness and, and press G and we'll just bring that in and up So, <clears throat> so we'll grab edges here. And I think we shall bevel these ones as well. And bevel. And that worked out straight away. Okay. Now I just want to come to these faces here. And just grab those verts. And just bring these back. So, it's going to quickly add an edge here and just pull that back. Grab this edge, frame up. See, this is way. Set like so and just bring down just a bit. Press G, offset, press G and down, and gives us some nice uh, edges there. Right. 
Library Selection. Grow selection. Mm, grow selection. edges here. So I'm just going to delete and polygon tool. So you can stick whatever you want in there. And frame up please and grab these. And we can bring this up. So you can bring that across. And we can add some air vents in here. So let's grab these. Okay. Extrude face and offset. Like so. And press G and offset. again and just bring those in and up it's about there I think just push those back Well, I say air vents when, in all fairness, it is a spaceship. So, um, you can make whatever you want out of that statement. Okay. that vast again so what we can do is let's check our time okay and slide and it's gonna extrude this up so and two edges 
and uh, okay. So we have that. I mean, that's just a fast. Uh, What do you call it? It's just a fast uh, quick fix. Just extrude those out. I'm going to extrude. Bring those out. these yeah we'll just keep it down like so there we go so we'll just keep it like that for now um, if we have to change it we'll change it so, what next? Okay, let's add a plate down here. We can have, we can have a big one here. So, we'll grab these and keep faces together. Extrude, and let's go to offset and bring this in. Press G and bring in so and we'll select these faces and extrude down like so and we shall grab this edge uh, around here around here and these and let's grab the corners and we can add one here but this time we should just do it this way offset like so press G offset again and grab these faces let's turn on our cute faces together and extrude and we'll bring those down and grab these faces to edges and oops, and bevel. Object board. Okay. Now we could do it for those. I'm just going to bevel these areas okay so there's this way to do the panelling uh, this way where we just uh, where it's a separate piece on top and this way with the bigger uh, extrudes inside now when I finish this lesson I will 
go ahead and add the rivets across here frame up and across just rotate so I mean, the little details help, I think. Let's bring that across and down. Now you can just twist. Okay, I want his clay street. Select, thank you. Thank you. Let's so we'll duplicate and then we can just bring this across onto here. And this one. Like I said, this these little details are uh, time consuming but, uh, just give the illusion that there's like little bolts <coughs> on there so go ahead and do what you like with the paneling, um, I think we will now just do some stuff underneath, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do some stuff. We'll, we'll get some stuff started at least. So I'm just going to go into my side view and just double check that everything is straight. Well, not that piece. But not that piece, but this piece looks fairly straight down here. Okay, oh, this is a uh, far too rounded for my taste So let's make, still on this side, let's make this uh, a live object and let's do a square or a cube and we'll just bring around about here and give it some thickness. Everything and let's get this placed. Bring this back, and it's way too. We want somewhat to line up with the end point here and somewhat of a gap down here. Okay, so 
grab this edge. save it and I'm going to save this and continue on before it crashes which I know my system well so uh, I'll see you after this